Fernando Pisani, of course, a former Edmonton Oiler. Fernando joins us this afternoon. Fernando, how did the idea for this uh, fundraising tournament come around? Something that I was thinking of doing and wanted to to do something nice and special. Uh, me being from this area um, and around where the incident happened uh, kind of hit really close to home and I was in a situation that I thought that I could do something nice and, and positive and uh, talk to a few guys in the alumni and uh, just kind of seemed to fall into place. So as you're from Edmonton yourself, Fernando, as well, a few Oilers uh, that are on the alumni team, it was easy to assume they were all on board for this hockey game. Yeah, I made a few phone calls and talked to some guys and, uh, you know, guys were like, sure, whatever you need, let's uh, let's try and make this happen. And uh, it was pretty pretty easy to do and pretty easy to set up. So you're taking part in the alumni game against the RCMP uh, this Saturday night in St. Albert at Service Place. Who are some of the other Oilers uh, signed up to take part in the game? Um, well, Jason Strudwick, um, Ryan Smith, uh, myself, obviously, um, Louis DeBrusque, um, Brian Benning, so we've got uh, we've got a few guys. We've got about fourteen guys in total. So we we've got some some of the older guys too. So it'll be uh, it'll be good. It'll be a lot of fun. One thing I love about uh, pro hockey players is that they always seem to give back to the community. Yeah, it's you know we've all been pretty uh, pretty lucky in our lives to play a game that we loved and and make a living at it. And I think any chance that you can to to do something in the community and and help out and make a positive impact. Uh, you know, I, I, we all kind of rally around each other, and that's something that we want to do. Fernando Pisani on the line this afternoon. Again, the Edmonton Oilers alumni team and RCMP are facing off in a charity fundraising game this Saturday night in St. Albert. Fernando, do you ever miss playing in the NHL? Yeah, you, you always miss. Uh, I think the biggest thing is just miss being around the guys and in the dressing room and the camaraderie that you guys had. Uh, you know, you have in the dressing room, and that's that's the biggest thing. You obviously miss playing uh the bodies uh, kind of tells you otherwise, but, uh, uh, you know, I, I do miss playing. I do miss being with the guys and, and being on the ice and being in that environment. Well, Fernando, of course, the Oilers have had a few disappointing years in the last couple seasons. Do you ever sit back on TV and watch and, and think, man, I should be out there playing? Uh, well, uh, right now it's uh, they're in a tough spot. And you know what? I don't, you don't really look back. I think I'm past that point where, you know, when you first retire and you're first done playing hockey, you always wish, okay, you know what, I wish I would have played and kept on playing. But now I've been, you know, I've been out of the game for, you know, three, four years, and uh, you get past that point now. It's all for a great cause uh, this Saturday night in St. Albert at Service Place. Fernando Pisani, appreciate you taking time out this afternoon. Oh, thanks a lot. Thanks for having me. Um, just wanted to add one more point about the game uh, there's only limited seats uh, at service, so it is going to be a first-come, first basis for, for the seating. So um, we just want to make that clear that uh, hopefully we get a, a sellout crowd. There's 2,225 seats available, so uh, we're hoping to fill the place up. Thanks, Fernando. Appreciate it. All right. Thanks a lot. Okay, see ya.